हेलो गुड आफ्टरनून ऑल स्टूडेंट्स हाउ आर यू ऑल फाइन नो वेरी गुड आई एम ऑल्सो फाइन स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न टू लेसन ऑफ इंग्लिश लेसन नंबर फोर एंड लेसन नंबर फाइव इट इज ओके विथ यू येस सो स्टूडेंट्स इफ यू हैव टेक्स्ट बुक विथ यू टेक अ टेक्स्ट बुक विथ यू एंड वन पेंसिल ओके एंड बी रेडी विथ योर वॉटर बॉटल ऑल्सो ओके स्टूडेंट्स सो लेट स्टार्ट द लेसन नंबर फोर नाउ स्टूडेंट्स हियर इन दिस पिक्चर यू कैन सी सम चिल्ड्रन एंड द मदर एंड फादर आर द एंड दे आर कन्वर्सिंग विथ यू और विथ ईच अदर एंड यू हैव टू लिसन केयरफुली दैट कन्वर्सेशन एंड You will also have to repeat the conversation after me. Okay, students. So here first a girl is there, and girl is asking to the boy, "Hello, what is your name?" So the boy replying, "Hello, my name is Soham. What is your name?" So the both girl and boy. is not a uh, brother and sister or any relatives or what they asking their names firstly whenever you meet someone you have to ask their names first so the girl is asking hello what is your name and boy replying hello my name is soham what is your name so the girl is replying i am reema How old are you? How old are you? It means the girl is asking the age of that boy. So the boy is replying, "I am six years old." So whenever you have, uh, you are asking about someone's age, you have to ask like this: "How old are you?" And whenever you have to give the answer of the question. you will say that i am 6 years old okay now the girl is saying good morning this is my father now she is showing her father to the boy and she is saying good morning this is my father his name is ramesh whenever talking we are talking about ourselves we are using i whenever we are talking about other selves we will talk, we will say he is or her like this okay so she is saying about her father so she is saying that his name is ramesh and he is a doctor so she is saying that my father is a doctor now boy replying good morning this is my mother now she is showing her his mother to him her and she is say uh, he is saying that her name is priya and she is a teacher now the boy is saying about his mother and her mother his mother name is priya and she is a teacher so the girl and the boy talking about their selves and their mother and father so the girl and the boy conversing with with each other and you also have to converse with anyone else like this only okay so students whenever you meet someone else who is unknown to you you will ask first that what is your name okay so we are starting our conversation with the asking name so students i hope you understood this conversation and you are, you also have to try the conversation with your mother father friends or anyone else with, who is available at your home and you have to converse you have to converse with them and when while conversation you have to take a video of your conversation and send that video on whatsapp group of school okay students so i will see you on that videos students we are going to learn our next lesson lesson number 5 let's learn alphabet students i have taught you 
the letters of alphabet and we have written that alphabets in our notebook also so students now we are revising these letters while revising you have to repeat the letters after me okay so first is look and say now this is small a say after me small a small b small b small c small c if you have textbook you also put your finger like this and repeat after me small d small d small e small e small f small f small g small g small h small h small i small i small j small j small k small k small l small l small m small m small n small n small o small o small p small p small q small q small r small r small s small s small t small t small u small u small v small v small w small w small x small x small y small y students you are repeating now small z small z students we will repeat these word alphabets again okay small a small a small b small b small c small c small d small d small e small e small f small f small g small g small h small h small i small i small j small j small k small k small l small l small m small m small n small n small o small o small p small p small q small q small r small r small s small s small t small t small u small u small v small v small w small w small x small x small y small y small z small z there are 26 alphabets are there and this is the sequence of this alphabets we cannot change the sequence of this alphabets after a it is b only after b it will come c only so it is called alphabetical order so students you have to say a b c d like this sequence in this sequence only okay students now you can see the second question is there tell a word that now students here is question number two tell a word that begins with any letter so first letter they have given us 
the letter T. So we have to find the words from given letters. So here they have given the alphabet from alphabet T the word of table. T for table. Now students quickly tell me another words from alphabet T. Quickly, quickly, T for table, T for tree, T for tent. Now, T for ten. Quickly, quickly. Now, one more, more words. T for tank. Very good. Like this, students, we also can play a game of alphabets. Antakshari of alphabets. So, Next alphabet they have given the alphabet B and they have given the word bat B bat we can say bat boat tell me another word students from B bat boat ball balloon butterfly more 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 words think about it bucket Basket. Very good. Now, alphabet C. C for cat. They have given cat. Cow. We can say from C, cucumber. Carrot. Cabbage. More, more words. C from C. It cut. Uh, more, more words. Think about it from C. From C, from C students, think about it, coat, very good. Now, the next alphabet is D, they have given the word of dog. They have given the example of dog, D for dog and more words we have to find out. From D, duck, very good. From D, Drum. Very good. From D. Think about it. Think about it. Yes, we can say dig. Very good students. Like this students, we can find more and more words from these alphabets. All words are started. All words are started with these alphabets only. So, there are lot of words and we can play a game also like this and we can find more and more words from this alphabet. So, students, you have to find 3-3 three, three words from these all alphabets. Okay. Now, students, let's read the capital letters. Here are the capital letters and now we are going to say these words. Okay. Now, students, I am putting my finger on that word. You also put your finger on that alphabet. Okay. And repeat after me loudly. Okay. Capital A. These all are capital letters. Capital A. Repeat after me. Capital A. Capital B. Capital B. Capital C. Capital C. Capital D. Capital D. Capital E. Capital E. Capital F. Capital F. Capital it means big letters. Capital G. Capital G. Capital H. Capital H. Capital I. Capital I. Capital J. Capital J. Capital K. Capital K. Capital L. Capital L. Capital M. Capital M. Capital N. Capital N, capital O, capital O, capital P, capital P, 
capital Q, capital Q, capital R, capital R, capital S, capital S, capital T, capital T, capital U, capital U, capital V, capital V, capital W, capital W, capital X, capital X, capital Y, capital Y, capital Z, capital Z. Students, we are revising this alphabet once again, okay? Loudly repeat after me. Capital A, capital A, capital B, capital B, capital C, capital C, capital D, capital D, capital E, capital E, capital F, capital F, capital G, capital G, capital H, capital H, capital I, capital I, capital J, capital J, capital K, capital K, capital L, capital L, capital M, capital M, capital N, capital N, capital O, capital O, capital P, capital P, capital Q, capital Q, capital R, capital R, capital S, capital S, capital T, capital T, capital U, capital U, capital V, capital V, capital W, capital W, capital X, capital X, capital Y, capital Y, and last one is capital Z, capital Z. So students, you have to write these alphabets in your four line CW notebook, okay? So write the day and date first, then write the heading of lesson number five, let's learn alphabets. Then write one more heading, small letters, then write A to Z in small letters in four line properly then on next page write capital letter heading and then write a to z capital letters in your cw notebook while writing write properly in four lines okay and you have to write these alphabets in cw part okay after finished your writing maintain your index also write the lesson number and name in the index also okay students i hope you understood the alphabets and conversation so we will meet tomorrow till then bye